This story developing this morning, the search goes on for a man who stole a vehicle in Delaware with a one-year-old child in the back seat. Thankfully, the toddler girl was found safely in Philadelphia about two hours later. But police are still on the hunt for that suspect and for that stolen vehicle. Action News reporter Corey Davis joins us from St. Christopher's Hospital in Hunting Park, where the young girl was treated. Good morning. Tam, good morning. So we're told that one year old girl was reunited with her family here at St. Christopher's. I want to give you a look there at the first of the two vehicles police are searching for. So they're looking for this black SUV in which police say the suspects were driving when they pulled up at a 7-Eleven on Gerald Drive in Newark, Delaware, yesterday evening around 530. One suspect got out and then jumped into a 2010 gray Nissan Altima. That's the second vehicle police are looking for. That suspect jumped into the car that was left running and drove off with that one year old girl in the back. The Delaware license plate on that Altima is five. 62644. Uh, we're being told that the vehicle has damage to the rear passenger door. So at around 7:30 last night, police were notified that the girl was handed off to a stranger outside the Food, Wine and Good Spirits store on North American Street and near Lehigh Avenue. Police say this could have been worse and that they appreciate the public's help working so quickly, but also have an important reminder this morning. Um, especially this time of year when it's colder and with vehicle thefts through the roof, not just in Delaware, but in the tri-state area, you really have to be careful. You cannot leave a child in the car. You cannot leave a car unattended warming. Um, you really have to take extra precautions. We need those cars found as soon as possible. So if you see something, please say something. So once again, the plate number on that Nissan Altima Delaware tags, it is 562644. Reporting live here in Hunting Park, Corey Davis, Channel 6 Action News. Tam. All right, thank you, Corey.